Hi guys, and welcome back to anti Dimensions. So it's been a day since the last episode, but look how many infinity points we have. 240 million. So I'm going to make sure I keep 100 million on me, and you'll see why, but I'm going to get this. Um, I'll maybe not get that because it's a bit expensive. I'll definitely get this. Um, and this, and maybe it wouldn't hurt if I just, I don't know, let's see where the infinity points peaks. I don't know, it looks roughly the same, but you know what? No, I'll get this after. What I'm going to do now is I'm going to go for E1100 antimatter because I think we're close to a seventh galaxy and we can probably do it. So I'm, it's just going to be like a normal run where you see how much antimatter I can get. This bar is the percentage to this. I kept forgetting to say, and I think when I re-uploaded the last episode to do a cut that I forgot to do, I also added that, like, as a text. Um, okay. We need, like, E969, and we're really close. So seven galaxies. We're just gonna push to E1100. It might take a little bit, but I don't think it'll be too bad. Um... Oof. Yeah, um, we're really gonna have to push here, but buying some of these dimensions and tick speed upgrades might help a little. Um, what if I just get, I don't know if this is the best option, but I'll, if I just get that, it might be a bit faster. Like, what if I just crunch and then try again? It should be at least a bit faster. I'm just going to get these dimension boosts. And then getting to the se seventh galaxy wasn't too bad. I just had to do a sacrifice. And now the tick speed upgrades are cheaper, so maybe it'll be just a little bit faster. Even though I can get only get one more tick speed upgrade, that's still good, I guess. I still have over a hundred million infinity points on me, which is what matters. And it's going pretty fast. Maybe I'll just... Yeah, maybe I'll do a cut and see you when I've got E1100 antimatter. So, um, it might be several minutes, but I'll see you then. Okay, guys, as you can see, we can buy one of these, which allows us to get another dimension boost. Um which might help a little bit, but it got a little bit slow, actually. That was probably... Well, it was actually... We've actually only spent, like, three minutes in this infinity, but... Um... This might be, like, about ten minutes, but shouldn't be too bad. So I'll see you when we get E1100 antimatter. So yeah, see you then. So we're coming up on E1098, and we're going to be able to buy this. So look what happens when it auto-buys that. It only goes down to 90, 1097, even though it costed everything I had. It's just a weird little minor bug there. I don't think it was intended. Um, I wonder if it has to do with like when the number is higher than infinity. I really don't know. We're very close to this. We can, we're gonna make it, guys. So yeah, I'll see you in what's probably gonna be a few minutes. It's been ten minutes already. This run isn't too bad, but um, we're gonna have to do a worse run, actually very soon. But um, yeah, you'll see. So yeah, I'll see you in a bit. Okay, guys, as you can see, we are nearly there. We probably just have, like, um, like, ten more seconds. We made it, guys. Um, yeah, ten more seconds. So, five, four, three, two, one. Here we go. Look, there's a new tab under dimensions. So this new dimension here, um, it costs a hundred million infinity points. So it gives us infinity power, which is translated to a multiplier on all dimensions. So look what's going to happen when I buy that. <laughs> it's crazy. Like, 
I I have eight galaxies now. And the worst one we're going to have to do later on is to get the next dimension. So it's just... Each of these buttons just unlocks new infinity dimensions. And um, for this one, we're going to have to get to 10 galaxies and getting, um, like, E1800, which is what we're going to need for the 10th galaxy. It's just, it just takes a really long time. But, I mean, look how much antimony we have once we got that new dimension. So, I'm going to do normal runs again. And I'm just gonna... 5 million... What? This is ridiculous. I'm gonna try 100,000. See how many infinity points per minute I get while holding M. Yep, 6 million. That is crazy. Now we're doing like 7 galaxy runs. So, when we infinity, our infinity power resets, and our infinity dimensions reset to their base amount, which is basically, like, you keep, like, the multipliers and stuff, but, um, like, these, um, the infinity dimensions after have to produce the previous ones all again, um, and it works exactly the same with a type of dimensions later on that we're going to unlock at a prestige layer later on. Um, it works exactly like that. Um, so, there's nothing really to do. Well, actually, there is something to do. So there's this achievement here that's possible now. Just go to any challenge that's not this one, this one, this one, this one this one, this one, or this one. So I'm just going to go into this one. Um, and I got zero deaths. Um, and so now you've got five rows of achievements. This is for beginning generation of infinity power. We're going to have to do a really long run to get this. So we're going to naturally get this one. This one we have to wait, but we'll naturally get it. This one we can probably get now. I'll just get them to like... 512. I don't know if this will give me the achievement. It might. Yeah, sometimes it has to be like above 512. Or maybe it's just a floating point error. So I'm going to get them to 1024. Because why not? That might have even given a boost. I'm not sure. I think our infinity points per minute is pretty close to the peak. Um, still kind of slow though. What if I don't hold M? It's like two million. Um, yeah. So if I leave this for a day, I'll probably have a few billion when I come back. Um, but I want to be really prepared for the next run. Sometimes I even get this to four times before doing this run, and then it only takes like two hours, but I'd say five times is, I'd recommend five times, I think. In that case, it takes like four hours, and I mean, I can just let it go idle. And I forgot to show you one thing here. It says, next challenge unlocks at 1e2000 antimatter. That, the challenge will be pretty easy to get and do once we've got the second infinity dimension. Um... And it'll take about five minutes, but um, you'll see why. Um, we might have to just like try again. Um, okay, so um, I don't really see anything else to do. I maybe I'll buy this actually. So this generates five percent of my best infinity points per minute, and I can kind of. Um, big crunch while the game's running, so it's just like a small boost to my infinity points. And if I hold M, this goes up. It's it's based on like my last few infinities. Um, so it just helps like a little bit. Um, and there is a max to this bulk buy. Um, it's just kind of convenient to get it. Um, it's possible to get much later, around the time that we unlock this. Um, 
So I actually don't think there's anything else to do unless I do a really long cut and buy this. So I think I'm just going to see you guys later. I'm sorry, but these this set of episodes might be short because it's kind of slow and we basically just have to leave it for long periods of time to get infinity points. Um, in my main game, once I held M for like two hours just to save up a hundred million infinity points for the new dimension. Um, so, yeah. Oh, and this upgrade will be useful for getting, um, I guess some infinity points while we're doing the long run. Um, we'll just have to remember to get a good infinity points per minute right before. So yeah, I'm sorry if this episode is short, it's just because this part of the game is kind of idle, but I'll see you guys in the next episode. And, um, the next episode might have to be, um, recorded over a long period of time in case I decide to just let this run go, like overnight or something, but I could try starting it in the morning so that I can get it up tomorrow. Um, and, um, I said, I commented on my last video saying that I would aim for one episode a day, but it might change based on, um, basically personal problems and if the game is slow at that moment. Um, and so yeah, I will see you guys um later bye